guys and welcome to vlogmas day 8 if you guys don't like my hat then just ignore it but I love it I feel like it's kind of a vibe just like I was saying in the other video but some of you guys might disagree so if you don't like it just bear with me I mean like is it a vibe do we do this or do we not I don't know I'm kind of, is this giving I don't really know or is it like without the hat hold on probably yeah Okay, I tried to be festive and fun, but it wasn't working. Okay, I think this is what we're going to have for the video. Are these ears to be festive? Or is this stupid? Hey guys, and welcome to another video. Welcome to Vlogmas Day 8. 8. Today's uh, vlogmas is going to be a bit different because today I'm going to be doing a sit down video and I'm going to be giving you guys 50 gift ideas in case you guys have not bought your gifts yet for Christmas. I haven't so if you haven't don't feel bad because I definitely have not bought my gifts yet. So without further ado let's get right into it. So the first one is a small vacuum slash electric, electric broom. Very adultish. Something that I want for Christmas is a freaking small vacuum, like an electric vacuum, because I hate sweeping. I don't know if you guys can relate, but I hate it. So I feel like that would be an awesome gift to give someone. Uh, Majuri croissant earrings slash croissant rings. So freaking fire. That's very specific, but Majuri, fantastic. Love their jewelry. Um, but to make it more general, you can get someone jewelry or like a charm necklace, a bracelet, that kind of thing. Um, perfume. So the ones that I really like are the Chanel Tendre perfume and the Louis Vuitton Sur La Route perfume, but you can get their them any of their favorite perfume or cologne. And the Ariana Grande I know just came out, so I feel like that'd be a really great relevant gift also. The third one, a film camera. I absolutely love film. I love taking film pictures, so a film camera is super trendy. It's great. It's always a good gift to give either a boy or a girl because it's pictures, and who doesn't like pictures? To go with the film camera is number five, film packs. So to just give someone film for Christmas, especially if you know that they have a film camera or they're into film and um, like taking pictures, you could get them a pack of film for Christmas. A Polaroid Instax Fujifilm. So one of those Polaroid cameras, I have a few of them. I had an Instax wide, I had like a couple, in, couple of Instax minis, but I want an Instax square. I know, it gets very, very particular, but I want an Instax square, and they have different film packs you can get for those also. A Fujifilm Polaroid would be a dope gift. A mini bag. You can never go wrong with a mini bag. A cute little mini bag, like a snake skin one, or like the little, I know that Telfar has like a bunch of bags. So just the cute mini bags, very trendy, very stylish. I absolutely love them. It's on my list. So I feel like if you give somebody that, you can't go wrong. A charm necklace, kind of like I mentioned earlier, but like specifically with their initial on it or something meaningful. Even if it's a locket with the picture in it, or if it's their initials, or their sign, like a little Leo one. I'm not just saying Leo because I'm a Leo, but, yeah. And vanilla body scrubs and washes. I absolutely love body scrubs and washes. If someone were to give me body wash, I would die. Underwear. Good old underwear boxers for guys. You know, you just, you give, give underwear you always need it. It's something that you're always going to need, so why not? Lounge sets. So the two-piece little lounge sets from, um, you can get them like honestly from anywhere. Pretty Little Things, Princess Polly has some, Amazon has great ones, uh, Urban Outfitters. All these little stores have these cute lounge sets and I think that that's always a nice comfy gift to give, especially during December and the winter coldness. Um, a ring light. Oh my gosh, I'm using a ring light right now behind my camera so when it's nighttime outside, you can still film videos from TikTok, take pictures, whatever you want to do. I feel like a ring light would be a perfect gift. You can get the bigger ones or they even have the cute little mini ones. Um, and I know that I got mine on Amazon, so go check that out. Um, some candles. Who doesn't love candles? Uh, candles are fantastic. My friend has a candle shop called Arctic Candle. I'll have a link in the description box in case you guys want to check it out. His candles are amazing, but like also Jackie Ina's line, Forever Mood, and just candles in general. Bath and Body Works, wherever you want to go, but candles are always a go-to. Blue light glasses. I'm on the computer 
24 7 I actually do have some blue light glasses which are fantastic I was able to get them from my job but you can get them on Amazon or anywhere but blue light glasses if you know the person is always on the laptop or if you know your boyfriend is always playing games or like whatever it might be get them blue light glasses it's very thoughtful it's a really thoughtful gift when you're giving someone something that is thoughtful because you know that they like that kind of stuff I feel like that means the most and so getting the blue light glasses is going to help with their eyes it's gonna help with um, not irritate their eyes as they're on the computer all day because I know I'm literally on the computer from when I wake up to when I go to sleep thanks a jade roller so a cute jade roller for your face um, you can get them at Amazon or any beauty store but those are very trendy really really nice whenever you want to do a little extra and treat yourself which is always good to do jade rollers are a perfect little gift a skin fridge I have one in my bathroom back in Miami and they are fantastic I put all my moisturizers in there sometimes my face wash my serums my lip balms it just keeps everything cold and cool and it's a little bougie little skin fridge I feel like anybody would love that. I also have my jade roller in there so you could get them the fridge and the jade roller which would be a nice little gift set. LED lights. Who doesn't like LED lights? It spices up any room that you put it in. I have LED lights literally everywhere in my house. Gift card. That's the you know classic. If you don't know what to get someone just get them a gift card. Get them a Visa gift card to anywhere and then that way they can purchase their own gift so that you're not just getting them something that they might not use or etc. Or if you know they really like a re restaurant or really like um, makeup or really like a certain thing like Starbucks, get them that gift card specifically and I'm sure that they would be ecstatic. Um, a heated blanket. During the coldness of the winter. Who doesn't like a heated blanket? Even if you live in a state like I do in Florida, right now I'm in Illinois so it's cold, but like I do in Florida, even if you live in a hot state, it's really nice to have a heated blanket in your, in your room. It's good for your back, it's good for your muscles, and it's good to just be cozy and cuddly because I know I'm always cold, so. <laughs> a mini waffle maker. I have one back in my house. It's so, so good, so, so cute. That's a great gift to give someone because it's just so cute and why not surprise them with a little mini waffle maker? Like, that's so cute to me. Um, a cheese board or a charcuterie board. Got it right this time. Um, that is a very nice gift to give someone, especially if you know they like snacking and they love cheese boards. You can go to Society6, they have so many good ones, so many good designs, and the great thing about it is that it pays the artist. For every piece that you get, it pays the artist. No, it's not sponsored, but I do love Society6, they're amazing. Uh, and NFL football. So this is mainly for guys, so if you guys are looking for a gift for your boyfriend or they really, really like Sunday football, this is going to be one that they're going to love, is to get the actual sized NFL football. If you go to NFL.com, the actual website, you can get them the actual sized football, and I feel like they would love it. Like, it's going to be a gift that will blow them out of the water. Um, a PS5 slash game. This is a little bit more on the pricier side, but if you are looking to give someone and you know that they want the PS5, I know that's it just came out and it's super, super trendy. My brother got one um, and it was so ridiculous. Like, we were all trying to get the PS5 at the same time because they were all selling out. But we did get it for him and he was very, very excited. So I feel like the PS5 and any games would be great, especially if you know that your boyfriend and or girlfriend or whoever it might be, sister, friend, cousin, likes games. That's a great gift to get. Cologne. Uh, just like I said, perfume earlier, cologne is always a great one for guys. I know the Dior Sauvage one is fantastic, but there's a lot of different ones out there. Um, a watch slash chain. So jewelry for guys and even girls, you could do a watch slash chain. That's always a great gift. The little dainty pieces is always something that's nice to get. Just because sometimes you don't want to spend that money on yourself, but if you get it as a gift, you would love it. A toolkit, so for guys mainly, but again, this can be for anyone. Um, a toolkit is great. I feel like guys are always wanting to fix things, and why not surprise them with a toolkit? It has all the screwdrivers, all the little knickknacks that they need right in one case. A robe, who doesn't like robes? It could be a silk robe for the ladies, it could be a more fluffy manlier robe for the man, for the men, but robes would be cute. And if you guys are a couple and you got, you're looking to get a gift for you and your boyfriend, you could get matching robes. So you could either do, you could do a black silk robe and have your guy do a more manly like fluffy or like I don't know cotton black robe or you guys can get the same robe and then just get it in your different sizes I feel like that would be so so cute a coupon book so I've done this in the past you can do a cute little coupon book on this site called like 
it's just type it up with an internet coupon book I promise like you'll find it somewhere but it's so cute you can make your own coupon book and like do like a dinner date or do like a drive movie or do like that kind of thing and it'll be super super cute they'll love it I promise and it's so thoughtful because you can customize it and you make like animated characters for each other and it's just the cutest little thing so I promise you they will not see that one coming a beard kit for you ladies out there who have men who have beards, get them a beard kit. Get them something to take care of that beard. Shea Moisture I know has bomb ones. I'm sure there's other brands with bomb beard kits, but that is going to come in handy. And it's very useful, something that they can use on a daily basis. A dinner night. Who doesn't like a nice dinner night? You know, we come home from work, we're like always working, we're doing things, we're busy, we're productive. We don't always want to cook dinner for ourselves, so to come home or to have like a little ticket or coupon for a dinner night would be so cute. Set something up, set up those little candles, you don't even have to spend that much money. Go to the store, buy the groceries, cook the dinner, and like surprise them with a cute little dinner date. And maybe you can even throw in a movie afterwards. I don't know if you guys saw the fight recently, but there's another fight coming on in February. So if you pre-purchase the fight and you know that they like watching those, they'll probably... They, first of all, thank me later because they're going to love it. A computer slash iPad. Again, this is more on the expensive side, but if you're looking to get someone an electronic, a computer and iPad is a good one because you can do so much on the computer. You can search the web, you can edit, you can watch videos, etc, etc, play games. But also an iPad's a little bit smaller, so if you know they already have a computer but they travel a lot or like, you know, they want to do art or like other things, maybe you go with the iPad. I have a book. Books are always a great gift to give. They're intellectual. It opens up space for that person to do something different than be on the screen, be on the TV, be on the computer, but a nice book. Atomic Habits is a good one. Um, also Relationship Goals is another book that I'm going to get into and I think that they would love it. So whatever they're into, you can get a book around that topic and I'm sure they would enjoy it. A tabletop Games. So Urban Outfitters has these tabletop games which I think is so cute. I actually have one at my house. It's the air hockey one. They have ping they have ping pong table, like a little tabletop. And when I say tabletop, it's like this big. So it's so cute and mini. And like you can play ping pong, you can do pool, you can do air hockey. But I feel like that's such a cute little gift to give. Socks. You can't go wrong with socks. And I'm always walking around the house with no socks. So I think socks is a really, really great gift. A leather jacket. So this could be any jacket. It could be the North Face puffer jackets that are super trendy right now. It could be leather jackets like the long ones that are really trendy right now or any type of jacket, the teddy bear coat, whatever it is, but who doesn't want a nice little coat, a nice jacket, so when you go out, you're nice and comfy, but you're also styling and profiling. AirPods. AirPods come in handy so much for me. Um, I use them all the time. When I have meetings and I'm downstairs with my family, but I don't want to like be isolated, I can just pop in my AirPods and be able to listen, or if I'm walking to the airport or walking outside or just wanting to, to listen to an audio book or something by myself, I can just pop those in and it's so seamless because there's no cord, there's nothing going on, just my little earpod. Coffee slash tea maker. If you know someone is a coffee lover or a tea maker, giving, getting them a coffee slash tea maker is really going to light up them. You can also give them some tea and coffee to go with it just so that they actually have what they need to use the actual machine. I'm an Echo Dot slash, Ale slash Alexa. Alexa comes in handy. I don't have one at, personally at my house. I do have an Echo Dot and I love it, but the Alexa that we have here at this house is amazing. If you're in the kitchen or cooking and you wanna you know, jam to some tunes, you could just say, yo Alexa, turn on Party by Beyonce. And then you know, it'll come on. And then like, it's just everyone's vibe, everyone's having a good time. So, always a great gift. Wine glasses. OMG. You guys, this is a big one. Like, I've broken at least like five or six of my wine glasses. So getting wine glasses as a Christmas gift would be fantastic. Like, who doesn't like wine glasses? Of course, this is a 21 and up gift. So, they're under 21. They don't need wine glasses quite yet. But this is a really, really great gift for us adults out there. Ugg slides. So those Ugg slippers, they're really, really popular right now. My sister got them for her birthday and they're so, so comfortable. So I highly recommend these for the ladies out there. They also have Ugg slides for guys, so you can check those out. I'm an air fryer. I have every single gadget in my kitchen except an air fryer. So I feel like an air fryer is a great gift. Um, it is a good way to fry your food without, with it being a lot more healthy because it's not oil there's really no oil required and it just fries it with air somehow some way 
a blanket. I am a huge advocate of blankets. And when we have one here, one under that, and one in front of me, I have so many blankets all over the place all the time. I cannot sleep without a blanket. Blankets is a gift that you can't go wrong. Like, who doesn't need a blanket? A record player. So this is a super unique and different gift. If someone is super into music, which I don't know who isn't, but a record player would be super cute. They have them at Urban Outfitters, but also Amazon and other sites as well. But they have really cute like pastel record players. You can get like matte black. But I think that that's, that's really dope. And a lot of them come with Bluetooth speakers, so you don't have to like buy all the records of all the different songs. You can buy some of like the nostalgic songs just for like aesthetic, but for, for mainly like for everyday usage, you can just connect it to Bluetooth and now you got your whole playlist running right off your record player. Reusable straws. So this is a good sustainable gift to give someone. They have glass straws, they have metal straws, and they have like silicone straws. They have so many different reusable straws and I think that getting someone a set of those or even a set of reusable dishware is really really useful and it's something that they can use in their everyday lives. A nail kit. So we're at home now, everyone is still quarantined. Yes, you know, people have come out of hibernation and it's that type of thing. But you can still use a nail kit. I go to the nail salon, I'm guilty of doing that all the time. But you could use a nail kit to do your nails yourself. You can get a nail kit literally from anywhere, but I recommend Amazon, the big one. I know I'm using that for everything, but Amazon literally has everything. It's a marketplace for literally everything. And the shipping is fantastic. Prime, if you don't have Prime, what are you doing? Personalized products. You can personalize anything on Etsy. You can literally go on Etsy or go online and just type in like custom personalized things and you can personalize literally anything you want. You could do a personalized blanket, a personalized picture frame, personalized iPhone case, whatever it might be. But that would be super cute and it adds a little personal touch just because you really took the time out of your day to make it personal to that person. And of course, I have to mention this one because it's where I work, but BoxyCharm. Get somebody a subscription to BoxyCharm. Get your girlfriend a subscription to BoxyCharm, your mom, your sister. They'll love it. If they love makeup and they want to continue to build their collection, BoxyCharm is the perfect thing to get them. So why not get them like a 12 month or three month subscription to BoxyCharm so they can build up their makeup collection. Last but not least, the gift of all. Money! Who doesn't freaking love money? If you don't like want to give someone a physical gift or you really just have no idea even after all of these ideas about what you want to get them, get them money. You can never go wrong with money. I said a gift card earlier but like physical cash, you could give them literally a lot of cash in the envelope but like give them money and they can buy anything with it. They can save it, they can put it in stocks, they can buy I don't know, a game they've wanted, they can do whatever they want. So if you don't specifically know what they want, then give them money so they can buy it themselves. So guys, those are the 50 gift ideas I came up with and my wish list. I hope you guys enjoyed and I hope that this was very helpful to you guys who have not got to shop yet. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye! Those are like great gifts to give. Great gifts to give. Welcome to Vlogmas. The uh.